bent here. But we want to do an visual inspection first. You want to see if it's bent. If it's bent, that's that's no good. You want to replace it because that's that's going to cause no harm. You just look inside there. Just look all three things. The flames look awesome. Your flame rod is bent, and you have no no soot. Okay. If you want to give it a look, I don't sure. know. The first thing you see in there is the flame rod. Okay. And then you see the flames behind us, how nice and tight they are. The, the cones. Yeah. They're, they're really, uh, fine. You know, they're, not, they're not blurry, but sharp, sharp uh, cones. That's a, that's a good burn. You find that's, a good, that's a good burn. You, you don't want to mess with that. Like okay. as far as uh, adjusting pressures. Uh huh. It's already it's already adjusted perfectly for you. Other, other than that, you, you already know your flame rod's bent. Okay. We don't have to test it. But to test it, say if you wanted to test the burn here, all we have to do you want to get it to fire, and you want to and you want you don't want it to. It's got to be on for a few seconds. See right there though, the read is good. See how it went up from three, it was 3.2, is that what it was at? Yeah. And now it's above, now it's at six, 6.7 volts. That's good, oh, that's a good one. If it was, if it stayed like at three, it's uh -huh. below four, you want to replace it, it's a battle. If you put a new one in and it was below, it was below four, you want to put it, you want to try to replace that new one with another new one. It could be a battle, you know what I mean? I see. But that, like that, that mini, uh, that millivolt, that's, you know, a small amount of voltage, you want it above 3.5. You know, you want to see above that. Okay. Now, I, I like seeing what I saw now, six. Even. But, we know it's bent, and it should be replaced. Mm -hmm.